you've watched Classic Game Room's Undertow with any regularity, you would know by now that I consider Back to the Future one of the greatest cinematic achievements in the history of mankind. But there is another film I hold in an even higher regard. That movie, no, that defining moment of American cinema is Ghostbusters. I guess he's right. What's your name again, kid? So, as a duly designated representative of the website, show, and corporate entity of Classic Game Room, I order you to cease any and all supernatural activity and return forthwith to your nearest convenient video games boutique to buy this freaking game. To capture stream or wrangler manually using this control. Above all else, Ghostbusters the video game is a love letter, 20 years in the making, to Ghostbusters fans. Written with love and care by developer Terminal Reality and the masterminds behind the films themselves. If you are a line-quoting fan of the movies, this game is going to absolutely blow you away with its meticulous attention to detail. From the cast, to the locations and the equipment, down to even the most trivial mementos from the movies, Ghostbusters the video game accurately and passionately celebrates the source material in a way that every other movie-based game on the market could really learn from. And a refund right now. All right, showtime. We wear him out, then we capture him. That's what your proton stream is for. You've got him on the run! Come on, let's go! Peter! Nah, I've seen this one already. You know how it scan is. Button. This will analyze the ghost's pe Careful. If Bustin' makes you feel good, Ghostbusters the video game is everything you've ever loved about life jammed into a solid video game. But if you've never really been a fan, or are perhaps too young to know about Gozer the Gozerian, the game's charms and jokes and references will probably go over your head as fast as a fourfold cross rep, a PKE surge of incredible, even dangerous proportions. Fortunately, the game is built upon a solid gameplay foundation that might make it worthwhile even if you're not familiar with the movies. Playing as a new recruit to the Ghostbusters squad, you assume the role of a rookie who joins the Boys in Grey on a new adventure set two years after the events of Ghostbusters 2. Old friends are inexplicably popping up all over the city, and it's up to you and the Ghostbusters to again save the world from MASS HYSTERIA! With an over-the-shoulder third-person perspective similar to games like Resident Evil 4 and Gears of War, Ghostbusters the video game is perhaps most accurately described as a third-person shooter. But it's got its own unique gameplay hook that makes it feel like much more than just another thoughtless movie time. Egon, how close do we have to get the big trap to reel him in? A lot closer than this. Nice boson! That really dinged him! Great job! Fulfilling the dreams of millions of nerds from my generation, the game arms you with an unlicensed nuclear accelerator and a ghost trap, and it's up to you to fire a proton stream at ghosts and drain their energy before finally reeling them into the trap. It's a really fun hook that makes ghost wrangling feel exactly like you imagined it would when you were a kid. Ghostbusters the video game does a great job of keeping its gameplay fresh, too. You've got access to plenty of diverse weapons, some of which are actually pulled from the movies, and each one can be upgraded. So as the game wears on, the methods you use to capture ghosts change as the spirits become more challenging. For example, some ghosts will possess nearby humans, including members of the Ghostbusters, and you'll need to hose them with your Ghostbusters 2 slime cannon to remove the spirit and then reel in the possessor ghost with your proton pack. So even though you're busting ghosts throughout the entire game, the gameplay never feels too stale or repetitive. Of course, as fun as the gameplay is, the game's most impressive quality is the depth of its Ghostbusters-ness. It's presented in a very cinematic fashion as a third Ghostbusters story, and in that regard it absolutely shines. Thanks to the voice work by the original actors, the endless references to the films, and the countless little touches like your health and energy bars being shown on the proton pack instead of on the screen, it feels exactly like the interactive third movie it was intended to be.
Sure, the writing isn't nearly on the same level as the movies, and the game runs a bit short, and there are a few presentational imbalances, but the minute you hear Dan Aykroyd and Bill Murray shouting at you as you bust ghosts side by side with them, none of that is going to matter in the slightest. The gameplay is fun, the online and offline multiplayer are surprisingly enjoyable, the spirit of the films is completely intact, and the game really makes you feel like a Ghostbuster. And if I lived a thousand years, I could never ask for more than that. Ray, I got coffee for all of us. But the little monster spilled it. And what's the story with those things anyway? No! Somebody help me! Easy now, miss. Just relax. No sudden movements. You're perfectly safe now. Sudden movements! Sudden movements!